Well, I've been a little lax on the videos, so. But uh, I got this tractor kind of about where I want it to be, I guess. Um, still need to do a little bit of work on uh, tightening the cab up, but. Uh, give her a little wax job. It was warm the other day. Painted up the wheels a little bit. Um, added a uh, lot better step. Yeah, we had to uh, conglomerate a little bit on there, but uh, a lot, uh, lot safer. Pretty sturdy. That's uh, where that came in because it wasn't all that sturdy without that. But not too bad now. Um, got the lights mounted. I don't know if I had that on there before. Uh, used some of that soundproof material to close that up. Um, this is one of the things I need to finish up. Uh, get that hole covered up some way or another. Or somewhat. Um... Yeah, I think a lot of this other stuff was was already done, but uh, the lights on the front and the back came with uh, that I bought had these uh, wire harness and switches, so I kind of made a little bracket there, put up there. Um, so now all the lights, my uh, good friend and neighbor. Helps me uh, in the helps me here and there. Uh, he's good with electrical, so he helped me get all that stuff uh, tidied up and hooked up. And we hooked it to the key switch, so you turn the key on, you get power to those switches. They light up, so it's dark or whatever. And uh, also, it was already hooked up this way before anyways, but the regular light switch, which uh, turns on like your dash light here. And uh, I got two lights that I added down here to the back. Turns those on. But uh, those lights aren't, I mean, they're, they're all right. They're not, they're not terrible. Obviously, it's light in here. But, uh, so, since that's all hooked up to the light switch, you know, you're hauling loads in or whatever, and it's dark, you, instead of sitting there flipping all them switches, you can just shut the key switch off and kills the power to all the lights. You don't have to sit there and monkey around with all the switches and whatever. So, pretty happy with how that turned out anyways. Um, yeah, I think that's, that's about it in here, uh, other than the floor mat. Also, that turned out pretty good. A lot of, if you've never done it before where you're kind of making your own, it's, uh, kind of, you got to do it right the first time. And so, it's a little bit of a slow process. Step looks kind of goofy on there, but uh, that's the way we had to do it. So, um, yeah, there's those lights back there, kind of pointed so that way, uh, when you the hopper seems like 90% of the time is always off to this side, so but you can adjust them and everything back there. Got the uh, engine oil changed and everything on it, so um, yeah, should be just about ready to rock and roll. So nothing uh, too fancy or anything, but uh, got it kind of the way that I want it. So thanks for uh, watching along, and uh, sorry I haven't gotten too much video on it but i've been busy doing a lot of stuff so you wouldn't think in december a farmer would be that busy but i've been hauling grain and dealing with pigs and projects 
end of the year stuff so anyways uh thanks for watching we'll catch you later